Your bonds are broken. The tyrant who ruled over this fortress has been banished. You are free to go. You are slaves no longer, so open the gates to freedom now! I don't understand. Why did all those slaves turn against us? Sudden freedom can come as a shock. A slave does not have to think for himself, and as long as he does what he's told, he's looked after. Freedom can seem like the harder option, because it means having to make decisions, and having to take responsibility for them, and not having a master to look after us and tell us what to do. Surely you're not saying that people prefer slavery? No, I believe that man longs for freedom. I believe it is man's highest aim. But the path is not always easy, and sometimes the life of a well-treated slave can seem comfortable in comparison to the challenges of freedom. Just goes to show how frightened they are of us. Yeah! Yeah! Very nicely done, my lady Farangese. There. And another one. Up. I'll stay and distract them whilst you protect Prince Arislan and break through their trap. It's our best chance. No! I won't have a splitting up like that, Darion. If there's to be a fight, then I'm going to be there too. We're all in this together, all six of us, and together we'll stand. But, my lord. No buts! <laughs> Those are commendable words. But from the way things look, we should divide ourselves into groups. And that way, we'll confuse our enemies. Remember, Narsus, I still want you to paint my official Imperial portrait one day as a live subject. So until then, I think it's a good idea to follow your advice. Is that clear? Where shall we meet up? Where the last intact forces of the Pulsian army are still holding out. The fortress on the eastern border. The fortress on the eastern border? That's where we shall find Kish Warden Bachman. At Peshwar, let's go! That's decided then. Hmm. And though it's far away, I can't wait to get there. Ha! Forward! Yeehaw! Yeah! My lady Farangese, wait for me! To Peshawar!
So Arislan has escaped. Yes, it is my fault. A thousand apologies, my prince. No, uh, Lord Silvermask. <laughs> we'll overlook it this time. Anyway, I know where they're headed. To join up with a warlord who was capable of defeating even your father, Carlan. Make haste in organizing the troops. If we move quickly, we stand a good chance of getting ahead of them. Yes, my lord. For the chance of revenging the death of my father and of returning Pulsar to its lawful heir, I, Zante, son of Carlan, promise to follow you and obey your every command. or you won't find your way back. Prince Arislan, please come back. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> Mommy! I want my home! Wait! Wait for me! Looks like you're lost, and you've a right to cry because being lost is a painful experience. But we'll soon find your way home. Oh. Come on, up you get. Thank you. Stop that at once! Oh! You are not to speak to slaves and common people. Why's that? Because as the future ruler of the kingdom, you are above the common man. And it is unfitting for a prince to lower himself by speaking to slaves or common citizens. So please do not let it happen again. Arislan, my son. My dear son, your beloved nanny who brought you up has passed away. Her spirit has gone to the world beyond. You must be brave, my son. You're no longer a child. The time has come to take on your responsibilities. You will soon receive your father's golden crown and become the crown prince. Huh? Oh, oh, the kingdom of Pulsar, the beautiful city of Ectabahana, all flames and destruction. Oh, ah, ah, oh, oh. Prince Arislam, Prince Arislam, wake up, wake up, wake up. Oh. What happened? Are you feeling all right, Prince Arislan? You were groaning a lot. <sighs> Where's Jeeve? He's gone to find us something for breakfast. I'm afraid my nightmare caused you worry. What can I do to repay you for looking after me, Elam? 